This is Brandy, otherwise known as Mystery of Diamonds, and welcome to my channel. If you're new here, hey y'all! Okay, so, um, I, as you should be able to see, I have new nails, okay? So I'm going to explain the nails. I did order this canvas from Amazon. I'm going to go ahead and give you kind of the specifics, just not the subject matter. So, I ordered this from the Ganba, G-A-N-B-A, Ganba store off of Amazon. I ordered it on May 3rd. At the time that I ordered it, it was $12.99. I just went and checked today, uh, which today is, oh, I think it's like the 29th, the, oh, the 30th, sorry, hmm. June 30th. My husband had to correct me there. Um, and so today it's $14.99 um, and it's free shipping if you're a Prime member. Um, so I ordered it on May 3rd and I received it on June the 6th. It is round drills and according to the site it's a 30 by 40 which is probably the canvas size but we will check it. Okay so let's see if you can actually guess the subject matter of this canvas. All right, so the clues are on my nails. All right, let me see. I'm going to bring you down just a minute so we can get you closer. All right, so here on the thumbs, and it's a little blurry. I was trying to see if we could get it. There we go. On the thumbs, and, and the, the denting is all me because I slept on them, and yeah, my daughter's not necessarily happy, but on the thumbs, we have horns with a purple and green gradient. On the pointer fingers, we have apples with green poison going down them with a black and blue gradient. On the middle fingers, we have the black and purple gradient with a nautilus shell. Think of nautilus shell necklace. On the ring fingers, we have the blue and black gradient with crowns. And on the pinkies, we have black and white, or white with black spots. All right, so I'm going to bring you up again. Whee! All right, so think Disney and these nails, the clues that I've given you, to try to see if you could figure out the canvas, okay? Now, I am really proud of my daughter because, you know, she came up with these designs, um, you know, and this is only her second attempt at being able to uh, paint designs on the nails, and I'm really proud of her. I think they look really cool. I have Disney nails. Okay, so let's see what we've got. I did go ahead and open the top, obviously, and let's put that to the side. Oh, look, you could probably already see what we got here. Because they just kind of, they kind of shout out at you, don't they? <laughs> All right, this is supposed to be poured glue from my understanding. All right, so we get a basic toolkit. So we get the, the little green boat. We get the little plate of wax, some baggies, and a pink pen. Basic standard toolkit. And I'm going to put the drills to the side. We'll get to those in just a minute. i got to fix this because, um, yeah. All right, so... If you haven't guessed by the nails, we have the Disney villainesses, or at least that's what I call them. We have Maleficent. Now, I did not do a nail for Lady Tremaine because I we couldn't really think of like what you could do on a nail for Lady Tremaine. So we kind of left her off. Then you have the Evil Queen from Snow White when she's in her queenly form. 
Then you have the Evil Queen when she's in the chrome form. And this is the one that we did. So we did the crown for this one. We did the poison apple for this one. Here we have Melissa Fence horns or what's on my thumbnail. And Ursula, as you can see, you know, she has that shell that she steals Ariel's voice in. Um, and... And of course, who could forget Cruella DeVille? <laughs> um, and so I'm going to try. The thumbnail is very, very small. Don't know if you'll be able to. Yeah, see, it's like super small and my camera doesn't even want to focus on it. What I will try to do. Okay, camera. Let's get back to focusing. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Did they cast a spell on you, camera? Come on. Did we cast a spell, camera? Okay. Okay. Sorry about that. Um, I had to refocus the camera because for whatever reason, I guess our villains, you know, somehow cast a spell over the camera and just were like, no. Okay. So, sorry about that. Alright, so you see these wrinkles that you see in the plastic, guys, that is just, like, it doesn't affect the glue whatsoever, and so, hmm, I'm going to bring you in close to the drill field, let's hope my camera behaves, so down we go into the drill field, and, I mean, let's look at these symbols, I mean, so far, it, it looks like we're, I mean, I see clear symbols. And these are alphanumeric. I mean, I think they're just, actually, I think they're just letters and one symbol. I think the only symbol is this dot right here. Um, hmm. So, let me see if there's going to be, let's look at the legend and see if there's any symbols that are going to trip me up. Alright, so M and N. Okay, luckily for me, like right here, we've got M and N. M is a very darker blue than N, so, okay, that won't trip me up too much. Alright, so actually I think I'm going to be good on this. So, wow, yeah, I think this is going to actually turn out pretty good. Alright, so let me bring you back up. Alright, I'm going to cover the ladies back up. Even though technically you don't have to smooth out the, the canvas with the plastic, I'm one of these weirdos that like, I, I don't know. I just, I like to feel, if I, you know, I, I like to feel the smoothness in the plastic. So that's just, that's just kind of me. Okay. I'll smooth you out. All right. So now let's look. Oh, I forgot to measure. Woo -woo. Bad, bad. Okay. So let's measure now according to this it's supposed to be a 30 by 40 but i have a feeling that's probably just the canvas so yeah we got 25 by 35 yep okay so the 30 by 40 is the whole canvas the drill size is a 25 by 35 but I kind of went with this because it doesn't look like there's a super amount of detail. I mean, you know, that's going to like cause us to go crazy. I think we're still going to be able to see the, the faces um, and everything. So I got my fingers crossed that this one's going to turn out well. Now, as you can see, there's no DMC codes on the side here. Um, and they do have two legends. They've got one on the bottom and one on the top. And I do like that. Um, so that, you know, if this gets covered over here, I do have this one to look down at. And when I'm down here, I have this one to look at. Um, and 
I do take my plastic covers off and I put uh, release papers on mine as I work on it. Um, that's just how it is. So let's look at the drills. Okay, so these are round drills. If you don't like the crinkling, um, go ahead and mute your phone uh, while I get this open. Personally, I like crinkling. Mm -hmm. This is a little bit flimsier bag than I'm used to. <laughs> All right, so let's see here. Are there DMC codes? Nope. All right, so these do not come with any DMC codes on the drills either. So, oh, what is this? Why is there sticky stuff on my canvas? That's, I mean, I thought the sticky stuff was just supposed to be on the front not on the back like oh my goodness what is that i mean i guess it doesn't really matter because it's not gonna show but i don't know mm -hmm. i don't like that sticky okay sorry sorry okay so let's just look at the colors all right so we have this pretty purple and then like a light lavender uh it's a peachy pink Y'all, I believe that that is black 310. <laughs> and then we have a dark blue. So this is probably like 823. And then we have another light purple with a little pink partier. Woo woo. You're being out. You've been a bad, bad drill. Your parents know you're out. <laughs> All right. Then we have like a gray. And now this purple I would probably imagine is 550 that's what it looks like to me and then we have like a green and then we have a light peach and then uh, it's like a not great pretty brown it's a I don't even like mustard brown <laughs> Or mustard yellow maybe I don't know that's not even mustard like my mustard is like this is honey Dijon <laughs> um, then you have like this really pretty blue Ooh, there's just some red with some blue hanging out with them and then this is another this is an even lighter peach here's another dark blue maybe I don't know, maybe nine what is that not Oh, see, now I'm going to forget it. It's like the 930 or something like that color. My brain just went bloop and didn't want to work on me. And then we have like another pretty blue. A lighter green. Uh, this is like a dark, dark gray with a yellow hanging out in it. Or is that a green? No, it was like a yellow. <laughs> and we don't even have yellow. And then we have what I call like a... This is like a purple brown. <laughs> All right, so it said that we're supposed to have 19 colors, and we have. Yeah, we have 19 colors. All right, so all of the colors are here. Like I said, I probably will not be. Uh, Keeping the drills after it because to me it's just it's if they don't already come with the DMC codes and them, um, I found that it can be a little pain to try I mean you can there are ways that you can go ahead and you can figure out the the DMC color like you have the uh, code book which I have and you could go and search it up but you know I have so many canvases that actually have DMC codes that I have a ton of extra drills and so you know I probably won't keep these it all kind of depends probably throw them away after I finish whatever's left over so I am looking forward to working on these villainous ladies um, I don't know about you but for me I love Disney and I don't know you know I liked seeing the aesthetic that the villains had as far as like you know they always seem to have like really cool outfits and I don't know they just were cool to me um, I did not root for them I did root for the 
hero, but you know, villains have their place. You have to you have to have the good and the bad, right? You know. So, all right, um, that's it for this unboxing. If you like this video, make sure that you hit the like button or the thumbs up button down below. And if you haven't subscribed, consider subscribing to my channel. I'd love to have you as part of the Diamonds family. Um, I do have Instagram and my email is linked down in the description. And I would love for you to leave me a comment. What's your favorite Disney movie? Are there any of these villains that are your favorite? And also, I'd love to be able to hear of the unboxings that I have already done, what is the next canvas that you would like me to start working on? Because, you know, I like to do my canvases and I like to come on and show you a post review. And like I said, now that my collaboration is getting close to ending, I will still be continuing whipping chats. And you'll see me working on canvases that I've um, unboxed on the channel, usually. Uh, you may see me working occasionally on one that I had prior to starting my YouTube channel, but for the most part, you're going to see the canvases that um, I unbox, and I want to show you my post review so that you can get a good uh, view of it. So, um, that's it for this video, and I'm going to leave you like I always do. Reach for the stars, grab hold, hold on, and never let go. Until my next video. Bye, guys.